Today we continue a conversation uh, about uh, how leadership is critical during crisis situation. And uh, we want to discuss a few things and a few thoughts about a word that is so profound to understand, especially when one is in leadership during what can be defined as a crisis time. And what is it that will keep you going? And uh, this word is agility, agility. Every person who is in leadership, whether you are leading a congregation as a local pastor, whether you are leading a company, whether you are leading in a political setting, the times we are in right now can be defined as times of crisis. Times of crisis because of resources uh, being, is like we, are, we are operating under where you have to be very conscious about your, your, your budgetary restraints. But one of the things, if you are a person who knows the Lord, one of the most important thing is to know when you don't know what to do, there is a God in heaven who hears and answers prayer. And one of the things we are called upon to do as leaders of every facet of life is to be able to encourage people not to give up hope, not to get to a place of hopelessness and despair. And uh, I'm reminded uh, of a scripture, and these were the words of, of Christ himself. In the book of John 16, verse 33, Jesus said, I've told you these things so that in me you may have peace. Yeah? In this world you have trouble, but be of good cheer have overcome the world. That's what we are reminded in the Holy Scriptures. And as we think about what we have been through during this very terrible time of COVID-19, the kind of setbacks that came in as a ramification of COVID-19, what you need as a leader is agility. You need to be able to come back. You need to be able to uh, get a, a, a resolution that you are not going under. It doesn't matter what, you know, situation you are managing. And uh, most of us know very, very well that you have had to balance a lot of things along the way. But when we think about the challenges that are one of the most important things in our observation is that leaders need to see the world and see the situations they face from a different perspective. And so I want to encourage you, do not give up, especially if you are a leader, because if you give up, what do you want your followers to do? As you, and I want you to know that everybody at any stage of life can be in a place where they can pray, they can declare that I have to depend on the wisdom of God in the journey of my leadership calling. Thank you, Lord, for the things that we begin to learn about how we need to stand firm and be able to have the, that ability of bouncing back after a lot of beatings that could be of any sort. We thank you because of your faithfulness in Jesus' name. Amen.